What's good, YouTube fans? Boy, I'm Measy2 live, and I'm back with another reaction video. The video for today, we got two people going on a date together. Um, the guy was running late, apparently, and because of that, the girl wants him to pay for her two kids' meals at the end of the meal so she can take home to them. Check, I'm paying for, I'm paying for my meal. And your meal. I'm not paying and for that kid's, kid's meal. No. Yes, you are. No, I'm not paying for that oh kid's God. meal. No, no. So, you don't think you owe me after having me wait an hour and a half? Now, I can only show a little bit because YouTube has been copy to right striking me. Even if I'm only using like 10 seconds, they'll copy to strike me for some reason. But, it is what it is. That's kind of the way it works. But, boom. The way I'm looking at it is, if, I do believe if you ask a girl on a date, you should pay for the first date. Just because you're asking her for her time, and that's just how I was raised. I'm from the South. That's just that's just how I was raised, to be honest. And it's personal preference. Some people may not agree with that. Some people think we should split it. In the last video I made about something similar to this, I had a young lady comment that she would rather split it so the guy doesn't feel entitled. I didn't even look at it that way. That makes a lot of sense. You don't want to make a guy pay for when he thinks he's entitled to the coochie because that's really not how it works, you know? But still, so this situation is a little interesting though. It's kind of like how that one girl had like four kids and the guy brought the McDonald's just to his one son, not the other kids. My whole thing and perception about this is those aren't my children. Even if we start dating, I'll have limited control over them. Of course, I'm going to provide for them if I'm willing to take on that responsibility. But, but. I cannot honestly tell you that I'm going to be paying for them off the rip. Even in the video, the breast, breast said, I ain't even met the kids yet. Why do I have to pay for her kids? My biggest problem with this video is the entitlement to him paying for that. If we're going on a date to get to know each other and working towards a relationship and working towards love, your kids shouldn't be a factor yet. That's what I'm saying. And I'm especially not going to buy something, especially food or anything like that, this early on for them. Especially not having them, having met them. Not that meeting them would change that. But not having met them or anything like that, it just shows how short this relationship has been. Even if it's, it's not a relationship, honestly. It's just two people going out getting to know each other. So even though you're investing your time on that one date, I don't think I would want to invest into your kids like that for their food. If I got it like that, fuck it. If, if, if the date was really that good, I'm like, you know what? I'm really ready to stick it out and see where this goes with this young lady. I may do it. But in my personal opinion, I don't think anyone's entitled for you to take care of someone else's kids, you know? Now, this whole video kind of seems like it was kind of staged. I don't know if it was staged or not. If it was... Hey, this is what it is. I'm always iffy about doing reaction videos to stuff that may be staged because it d takes away the authenticity of it. But it does show how interesting the dynamic is, you know? Between um, not a, a potential stepfather, not a stepfather, a potential stepfather and the mom. Like, how soon do you have to take on the responsibility of providing for those kids? Regardless of if the father, the real father is there or not, like, when do I actually have to step up to get that role? Because, to be honest, I barely know you. We're just getting to know each other and it's building up. I, I'm not sure I'm willing to, I'm not sure I'm willing to do all that if it doesn't go anywhere. Not saying it's bad to, you know, buy some kids some food. But at the end of the day, I feel like a lot of guys nowadays are scared of being played like a sucker or like a fool or anything like that, or a trick, you know? Because dudes get finessed for food all the time. Now, if I get finessed paying for your dinner and your kid's dinner and this don't even go nowhere, it's just going to hit different. And I don't know. I'm on breast side. That's basically the video. I'm on old boy side. I can't, I can't side with... The entitlement. Maybe if I was feeling generous. Maybe if I, I feel like if I feel like even if I had it to that extent and I was where I would want to be in life, like at the upper echelon, and I, I'm secure, my bag is so secure that I'm not worried about shit. I may offer to at the end of the day, knowing that you have kids. 
But her trying to imply that he has to, that's a that's always a turnoff for me. Cause I don't I don't like the whole entitlement wave of you gotta do this, you gotta do no, 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 no. This is an equal partnership if we're going into this together, and that's how it should be. So now the funniest part about the video is when he's walking around and asking for other people's validation to make sure he's right. It's funny because that's me. Like, if, if I'm having an argument or a disagreement and I don't feel like I'm actually wrong, I definitely just pull around and say, hey, bro, hey, bro, let me know what you think about this. Just because I know in my heart of hearts I'm not wrong. So that part cracked me up for sure. But, yeah, I have to side with old boy just because even though he was late, I don't think she's entitled to him paying for their food yet. If it develops into something more and we get to that point, sure. But I think even even the guys that do step up and become stepdads, I do think we have this, as men, we have this innate feeling of not wanting to take care of another person's kids just because it, it, doesn't, it doesn't feel right. It feels like it's not your responsibility. I don't know how to explain it. I know that sounds terrible, but that's just that's just how it feels. Like it's different for like someone like me. I have nieces. I, I buy my nieces shit all the time just because I love them. You know what I'm saying? I watch them grow up. I feel responsibility for them to some extent. Me taking this girl out on a random date to Red Lobster, I don't even feel responsibility to take. You know what I'm saying? I don't, even, I don't even feel a responsibility to take her out again, let alone take care of her kids just this one time because I was late. And the thing about the late thing is I don't think she was even saying that because he was late. I think she already felt like that way. He had had to do it already. Like she felt as if that was his role he already had to play. So for me, that's a red flag. I'm on the side of old boy. And yeah, that's the video for today. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what y'all think in the comments.